All right, it's 1239. I'm already back in Dallas from Corsicana. Uh, I originally went to Corsicana because I needed things, some clothes for Vegas. So I got those. And then I was going to go to my barber shop because I don't like the barber shops here. I have a guy that I like in Corsicana, believe it or not. And he was closed. Uh-huh. Yeah. And then I go to try and get my eyebrows done at the place that I get my eyebrows done in Corsicana. And <laughs> they're not even in a store anymore part the funniest story about all of this it's been a long time since i've i've been in my apartment like i literally just have not been at my apartment i've not been in chris can i've been at home with my family and um my mom couldn't figure out why my electricity bill was even a bill because i'm not there so all the lights and stuff are turned off the ac is turned off and we couldn't figure out like why are we getting charged what's what is turned on uh, LOL, I walked into my apartment today and this is what I saw. <laughs> are they on? <laughs> my How LED lights have been on, flickering green the entire time that I have been at home. What am I, the Hulk? It's just, my room has been getting lit with the lights. They've been getting lit with the lights, oh my God. But I just wanted to show y'all my new shoes that I just got in the mail. Morgan got them for me for Christmas. And I'm obsessed with them. They're cute. Okay, so I'm gonna be doing two different DIY t-shirts and both of them are the same concept but two completely different things if that makes sense. So I'm gonna be doing the um, safety pin t-shirts to where like they get cut and then like you add like safety pins to them to like effect. I saw on my For You page one day of Josh Richards wearing an ACDC shirt and like the sides of it right here were cut off and like safety pinned and it was so freaking cute and then I just started seeing them everywhere. I started seeing a bunch of other TikToks wearing them, TikTokers wearing them. So for starters, I'm gonna start off with this t-shirt that says Los Angeles, that's literally it. But before I do the safety pin stuff to it, I'm actually going to tie dye it. Actually not tie dye, I'm gonna be bleaching it. So we're gonna start off with bleaching this shirt and then I'm going to start on the other shirt. Kidding me? I was literally throwing away wrappers and I just threw all of my rubber bands in the trash can. Ah. Oh, nope, I gotta go get new rubber bands, BRB. Where do I want the spiral? That's, that's, ooh, okay. So maybe like, right here. Well, I'm gonna be cutting it anyway, so it doesn't really matter. So we're just gonna spiral this up. I really hope the bleach doesn't like, eat away at this shirt. That'll be really unfortunate. Cause like I have this vision in my mind for this shirt. And my vision, praying to God that it comes true, I feel like it's gonna be so cute. This is my little t-shirt. All right, so I have my shirt all ready to be bleached. Guys, my outfit look, like, okay, I do look cute, but like I said, I got my bleach in here, so I guess we're just gonna soak it on there, I guess. Oh my God, it's already turning colors. <gasps> Why is that like an instant reaction? <laughs> Do you guys see that already? Look, it's already like, look at that. It's only been a couple minutes. Okay, I feel like that's enough bleach, right? My bleach shirt is in the wash right now, and I'm gonna get started on the second shirt that I'm gonna DIY today. So this is the shirt that I'm going to be trying to recreate. It's cut off like on the sleeves and safety pin. So I'm gonna be using this Metallica shirt. This is what it has on the back. I'm just literally looking at this picture and I'm hoping for the best. So I guess the materials that you're gonna be needing for this project are um, safety pins. And I got two different kinds of safety pins because I wasn't really sure which ones I wanted to use. Cause I got the really big ones. So 
I got the really big ones, the medium big ones. I don't, I can't tell looking at this picture what, what, I can't tell which ones these are, but I really feel like these ones are these bigger ones. I don't know, can't really tell, but I'm almost positive that that's what it is, so we're just gonna go ahead and try it and, I don't know. Okay. Maybe. Maybe. I feel like I could use this like right here and like match them up so I can like cut the line. Okay, so we're gonna start off by seeing what it looks like to have. I don't know. I feel like this just might be too big. I think it needs to be like a good like spot. It might need to be the smaller ones. I don't know. We're just gonna go with it. We're just gonna run with it. I dig it. My mom said it was interesting, and but it's just it's just not her vibe. Off to shirt number two, and this is actually it's done in the washer and everything, and this is how it turned out. The bleach dye turned out really good. I actually really like it. I love the way that the bleach looks and the colors all ended up looking, and yeah. So originally my thought process was to cut it in the middle like a crop top, and then do the safety pins. But I think I'm just going to go down the center like this and open it up and then safety pin it back together. I think that might look better than just cropping it and going down the middle, you know? I'm going to go ahead and cut this. I don't really know what the middle is. So I feel like I just need to like yellow it, right? I mean, that looks like it could be the middle. I don't know. Hopefully, because we're cutting. Oh, period. So now I just have an open shirt. Alright, now it's time to safety pin it back together. Let's keep it going good. I think this one right here that I'm working on might actually end up being my favorite. I feel like the second one's like always the best one though. Okay, so this is what we got so far. Okay. Second shirt is officially done. My second DIY shirt of the day is officially done. And this is how it turned out. I don't know how to feel. This is the LA shirt. Mm. This Metallica one is for sure my favorite one of the two. For sure my favorite. Um, I'm gonna play around with these shirts a little bit, so... Check out my Instagram for the final product because that's probably where it's going to be because I might mess around with these just a tad and see what I can do to make them a little bit better and a little bit more exciting because I just... Okay, so I played around with this one a little bit and I took out a bunch of the safety pins 
So there isn't as many safety pins in it and I think it looks so much better like that. There's more room for it to like actually like be open and stuff. So, okay, this is sure. This is my favorite one for sure. It's actually really cute and I just made TikToks in it and it actually looks really good. So <sighs> I'm in love with this one. This one worked out just perfectly. Now I gotta figure out how I can make the other one better because it's just, it's not it. Yeah. Honestly guys, I just think my brain is just not working and I think that this shirt just, we're just gonna have to say RIP to this one. I just can't seem to figure out what I wanna do to it right now to make it look better. And I just really sucks. I'm still gonna wear it for sure. But I just, right now, I just, I just don't know what I wanna do to make this look better. But these are the two shirts that I made today. I hope you guys love them. Um, if you have any suggestions, comment down below what you think would look good for this shirt, but. Big, 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 big.